No. No. Wait. Oh. No, I'm on the wrong map. I think. What the fuck? Do you want the police station? Mm, do I? I don't know what you're What are you looking for? A thing that I can open. <laughs> with what? The electrical. The with. It's in the uh, chief's. This. Place. Damn. <laughs> That's fucking bright. Oh. Oh my god, please. <laughs> Just give each other like eye exams. <laughs> yeah. Have you seen those like eye exams on YouTube? There's like, well, it it fits under the ASMR thing. ASMR. ASMR. Asthma. Asthma. <laughs> Let me uh, tickle your asthma there. <laughs> Go ahead, dude. Oh, you're not wearing headphones. I am. I could tickle my own asthma. Oh. With some asthma? Yeah. It's by the gate, bro. Oh, I didn't even see the gate when I walked past. Open the box, bro. No. It'd be funny if you like open it and it's empty. Pretty sure I need two. You do need two. You can still drop it in there though. Hey God. Hey God. Fuck you, bitch. Wow. Done, son. Boom. Beep. Boom. God damn. Oh yeah, another time that I think uh, was a good content was Halo yeah. Two. When you just went off on that one song. You're <laughs> Singing Jesus of Suburbia. Yeah, for like, tw how long? Ten, nine that? minutes, because that's how long minutes. the song is. Yeah. I tried squeezing some words, and you did no. Yeah. No. I wasn't <laughs> having it. You weren't interrupting my song. Oh, I definitely wasn't. Just nine minutes of just pure. <laughs> 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 See, I don't know if that's good content, but I enjoyed it. Uh, definitely was. I uh, I think uh, the ending there really helped because I was like, "What the fuck?" fuck? It. We just start laughing. And... <laughs> <laughs> it's like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck was that? And you thought it was multiple songs. Yeah, I actually did because it was so long. I was looking at the recording. I'm like, okay, <sighs> okay. So it's roughly about this time. At this oh, point, wait. he's going to stop, and you just kept going. What's in that room? Uh, Dad. Going. going. Oh, nothing. That's where I found the film and pulled that to activate the elevator. But it's still red. I know. I don't know what I'm missing. <clears throat> Fuck it. Might be connected with the other room. There's nothing you can break in this room. Oh. Oh, Jeez. That's what it is. Hopeful. <laughs> that is hopeful, actually. I can't get in there yet. <sighs> Damn. There you go. Yep. Figured that out already. Thanks for that, though, Claire. So was I right with the whole, like, pedo vibe with that guy? Uh, I don't think he's gonna do, he's he'd do anything with Sherry, but yeah, he's pretty fucking weird. Like if you read that taxidermy uh log that Chase picked up, it gets a little a little weird. Yeah, Ooh. I thought those were about people, so I didn't. Well, I figured out it was actually animals. Well, he's like, I need something bigger, and then he gets a cat, and he's like real excited uh... about it. And then he gets a pig, and he's like, Oh, this skin is so soft. And yeah, it's kind of weird. What the fuck? Yeah, he's kind of he's fucking strange. free. That's key card that over there. The thing. So you played have. Claire, right? <coughs> I haven't finished her though. Okay. Well. <coughs> but you're way far into Claire, right? Yeah, I'm in the sewers. Okay. 
That is absolutely disgusting. Oh! I, that mic picked that up somewhere in the headphones. Cracking sure that, his neck. Yeah, I'm like, like I heard every. Crack. That's geesey. Felt Ab- nice though. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! <laughs> He's turning. He's gonna turn. <laughs> Oh, God. Fuck it. Might as well. I don't need ink. Not unless you're on hardcore. Spam that shit. Wait, is that an actual <coughs> thing? <coughs> yep. On hardcore, you need ink ribbons. ribbons. To save? Yeah. <laughs> the fuck? It was a thing in uh, the originals. Resident Evil 1. No matter what yeah. difficulty <laughs> you were on. Yeah. Oh. I haven't gone down here yet. Nope. It's best to come down here when Mr. X ain't coming after you. Because then he ain't going to say hello. No. Wait there. No, he's going to come in. Wait there. He's coming. Claire. Wait. This is the chief room. You're blowing pretty heavily into that microphone. That's Yeah, that's the point of the joke. Thank you. (laughs) It was not pleasant. You weren't tickling my asthma. You're wearing, like, super sensitive-ass headphones. If anybody watches this, it'll be on, like, a computer speaker and or TV and, and or telephone. Or shitty headphones. Uh, yeah, and plus He's YouTube. Done He's done it. He's done it. Oh, wow. He didn't come in. And plus YouTube has, like, a really bad compression <laughs> thing. Haha, <laughs> XD. And it's actually quite... Like Disney XD? You know what I recorded today? W- what? Beanie Simford. I don't think that's on anymore. I can, I can never find it. I'd love to buy it, but I don't think they they sold it put it into DVDs. Uh, they ended no. that series. Yeah, I know. It was a good series. I like yeah. that show. Uh, anyways, live action Kim Possible movie that uh, came out today. Right. Yeah. <laughs> right. I remember. It's probably going to be awful, but I want to see it. And I, I like the guy who, or the kid <laughs> who's playing Ron. <laughs> Yeet. How would you do that? You can't see. It knew I was there. I sprinted into that fucking room. Yes, please. <laughs> I will take that. There was something <coughs> under that table. No, there wasn't. I thought there was. Or like on the bottom side of the table? There is something on the other side of the wall, though. Uh, or no, that's just a jump over. Oh, there has to be something important in here. There's a clover key. Oh, uh, it doesn't look. do you any good. <laughs> confiscation report. He's in vision. He's in vision. And a note. He was confiscated. I'm looking for a note. There's a scrap of paper in a plastic bag. A note. It was a safe combination. What? Yeah, look at it. <laughs> Keep going over. Oh, six. Two eleven. I haven't found a safe that I know of, that I can remember. Anyway, there's one in the west office, and there's one under that desk. You honestly probably could have just left him alone. I have to jump through the window. So, Pre- he- is that room clear? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. But is this not going to make sound? I don't know. Just run. He's not going to follow you. There. You're good. He's not going to come. For some reason, that oh no, you are missing something in that room. It's still red. <coughs> what? Just be quiet. <laughs> Sad. Oh, that's good. You want that? Fuck. Get rid of it. I'll be right back. It's really important. I'll be, I'll be that's back. how you get the machine. We don't have to whisper, you're not in that room anymore. Is he falling? I don't know. It sure sounded like it. Fuck. <laughs> you have to die. Keep talking. Oh, well, I, I like know. just playing the game and not doing commentary. It's uh, Also, me and Johnny have to talk? Yeah. 
<laughs> That's how it should always be. World. Because I feel like Chase doesn't really like to talk too much. Yeah. Is this true? Well, I talked in fear. It was fun. True. Did you play fear alone? Yeah. Yeah, he played. Oh, well, it was kind of like mandatory. I find it's really hard to do like solo commentary. I find it easier. No, it depends on what I'm playing. Yeah. Because I was really, I'm fine at doing it in Dead Space, but <laughs> I can't. I was not able to do it at all in Morrowind. Hmm. Hmm. Um, cause yeah, my doom stuff, I just ended up playing the character. I was like, Ooh, yeah, let's blow this shit up. Mm. That's fine. But I do remember your jet set radio stuff was, Oh, that was, that was, that was terrible. Especially since you took a phone call and walked <laughs> away and didn't edit that out. <laughs> yeah. Regrets were made. Did it? Did we? No, I don't We deleted it. that stuff, right? Did we? I don't know. I should have. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> He's on the roof. Fucking creepy bastards. Creepy bastards. Oh, oh. Clover Key. care kind of care but what it's high grade gunpowder that's awesome you make machine gun ammo i know that's why i kind of care but not at the moment go put this in the box you can open it go put it in the box do you need a gem yeah you have it it's in the box you just don't have it oh i get it i think did he get in i don't know <laughs> no he just broke the window what an asshole. It's a little rude. It does work for this establishment. Yeah. What's not anymore. Not after that. Yeah. It's kind of questionable. If he, like, still has a job or not. He might. Chief mm -hmm. Irons is a pretty corrupt fuck. Yeah. Apparently he likes pigskin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that. He's one of them. Aha. Oh. Good job, dude. I'm proud of you. Man. So how does this give you the What the fuck <laughs> Now you have that You can go and access the computer <clears throat> In the star's office And it'll open the armory Where the fuck was that Second floor Other side Left Red room right there God <laughs> So far away I don't even know if I can get back there at the moment or can I? <laughs> One, yeah, right away. You need to go outside. Go up the stairs, go outside. Right. Right about that. <clears throat> Interesting. X gon' give it to ya. Oh, my eyes! Sorry. <laughs> it, it's okay. <laughs> it's pretty bright, though. It is. <sighs> For a shitty little <laughs> fucking pocket knife. Yeah. Has my company on it. And my company's phone Your number. dick. Wow. Now I gotta heal. Why are you going that way? Isn't this the way? No. Oh, no. oh good. <laughs> oh, no. You miss. Fucking asshole. See what you did. Now I gotta kill ya. Maybe. What the fuck? Wow. That's not him. Ugh. You did this. You made me do this. You know what that's from? Batman? No, it's from Walking Dead. Oh. Who was that? Don't tell me. Right, it's Rick. Yeah. After he stabbed Shane. Yeah. Actually, I actually watched that clip today. <laughs> I was Got watching up. top no. 10 most badass moments of The Walking Dead, and I didn't agree with very many of them. Wasn't <clears throat> there, like, uh, a moment where... Uh, yeah, I haven't seen The Walking Dead except for the first episode. But I want to see more. 
but I think I'm way too far back to... It's all on Netflix. Oh, God. <laughs> Season one's very good. Season two is... Really boring. Garbage. <laughs> it's not garbage, but it's boring. Okay. There are some important parts in it. Uh, season three is okay. decent. That's when season one four. of the main villains finally shows up. Season four is very good. Yeah. Season five is... Gets a little... It's kind of good. Yeah. It has its moments where it's really good, but it also has its moments where it's really slow. Season six starts picking up because some really bad people start showing up, but okay. not half, until like halfway through. Isn't The Walking Dead... The No, I'm thinking Game of Thrones, sorry. Where the live action has caught up to the books. So now... Yeah, it's Game of Thrones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think Game of Thrones is doing their last season this year, actually. Yeah. Dude. And Walking Dead's still going somehow, even though Rick's gone, which... Yeah. Didn't... Didn't Rick die after season one? What? No. Rick still hasn't died, technically. Shit. No, he's dead. No, he's not. Then who dies from... Literally no one important in season one. Yeah. Really? Because I was told that the main character you follow in uh, season one just dies and you follow somebody else in season two. That's absolutely wrong. And I have no fucking idea who you heard that from. Are you talking about the, are you thinking of the game? Maybe? Because uh, Lee dies in the first game. Uh, and then you're following Clementine instead. That's mo- That's probably where I heard, but I thought... But What's but up? but my brain went from like season one of the game to the actual like live action, and then I'm just like, well, oh. what's the point? No, uh, Rick's Damn it. still alive. Technically, he's not in the show anymore, but he's still alive. <laughs> okay, so, um, but he doesn't leave until episode six of season nine, I think. Okay, there's a uh, one part. Dick. In uh, in The Walking Dead, that I kind of want to get your opinion on, yeah, because I know this. Uh, it was at the end of a season where Chinese guy and somebody else hops oh, down. Oh, he got Glenn. Uh, no. Oh. Are we talking Glenn with the baseball bat? Yeah. What are you talking about? Keep going. No, uh, I was gonna say like he he survives by going underneath a. Uh. A car, oh shit! I think X gon' give it like, th- like, like Is they that... filmed it in a way that they made it seem like he was gonna die, and then he like shows up. Oh, like... the Asian guy? Yeah. Oh yeah, because he falls into a horde of zombies. Yeah. With a body on top of him, but he pulls himself underneath the dumpster. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who is this V for Vendetta boy? That's Mr. X. Okay. <laughs> uh, what are you wondering about <clears throat> that part? Uh, I kind of want to know your thoughts on that. Like, what does that even mean? I don't know. <laughs> Like, because uh, I haven't seen it, so... Um... When I first saw it, I was like, you can't be fucking kidding me. He can't just die like that. But Walking Dead does this thing where if you don't see it happen, they ain't dead. <coughs> like, you actually have to see it happen. Whoa, oh, right. fast boy. He, Woo. Uh, yeah, he's fast. And he'll almost follow you anywhere. Um, but yeah, if you don't actually see it happen, oh. then they won't be dead. They'll show up at some point. Interesting. <laughs> what even are you? He's a tyrant. I don't know what that means. He's a big B.O.W. Is he a nemesis boy? Uh, a lesser version, <laughs> yes. Uh. S- sent to wipe out uh, people who might be able to uh, tell an umbrella. Um. Yeah. Oh, it was a good part. Okay. I liked it. It was the good. Heck? But yeah, it was... Like if you don't really know, the Walking Dead's method of how they do stuff, it's it's pretty upsetting because Glenn was a pretty important character at the time. Ah. Uh, ah. Okay. There's nothing this way. This is a bad idea. There's absolutely zero things down here. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh fuck. Now. So is that guy a zombie or does he? He's a B.O.W. <laughs> so kind of. He's so just he's a, a mutation. A, yeah. He's a big fucking. So he mm. knows what he's. <laughs> Seeing and doing. Yes, he knows exactly what he's doing. He's uh, so he's a big uh fucking experiment by Umbrella, who is uh he's programmed to uh wipe out uh any evidence of what's happening in Raccoon City, and that evidence being anyone who's still alive. Oh, awesome! 
Awesome. Uh, you need to go back where you found them, dude. Oh, that's what I thought. <laughs> but I wasn't sure. There are some rooms he won't follow you into. Uh, yeah, obviously. This one. Hello. Ooh. I'm surprised he actually stayed there. <laughs> oh, I actually don't really have anything open for him to go there. <sighs> nope. Ah, oh, shit. Don't look at me. Haha. <laughs> 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 no ladder for him? Probably not. He doesn't use the ladder. <laughs> <sighs> no. Um... I'm going this way. What items do you have? Uh, what are we even doing right I now? I have the badge and heels and keys. All right, you can go to the star's office. Oh, right. I know what you're doing. <coughs> you need to get to the oh, top floor to get the electrical piece. Let's just run across the, the main room. Where the heck am I? You're in that room. Oh, there's a, there's a, a, uh, there's a safe in oh, there, actually. There Behind, behind the desk there. This might not be safe. Not gonna lie. That startled the shit out of me. What? Oh, the door? <laughs> yeah. Slight little heart attack right there. Ooh. Oh god. Oh. Where am I? <coughs> Where am I going? Where am I going? Just run across. Okay. Go go into the library <laughs> and go through the door. Damn. What's up, bro? I'm trying to think of something to talk about right now. Ah. What? It's in that room. <laughs> Something you missed, apparently. So, Al, how, how old is she supposed to be in this? 18? I don't know. Hold on. So, wait, what? What was uh, her job before this all went down? I don't have a clue. Why is she dressed the way she is? It's a biker uniform, yo. Is it? Yeah, she's on a bike. Yeah, I know that, but you could like literally that's, wear. That's anything. technically not the costume she's supposed to be wearing. Oh. Is that deal uh, stuff from? No, like... it's something you unlock for beating it. Uh... There you go. That's um, that is her original like. costume in uh, the original though. Oh. Okay. Cause I'm like looking at this. I'm like, is that like a stars uniform? Like, what the fuck is that? All right. So this took place in 1998. She was born. She's nine. She's 19. She's 19. 18 or 19 depends on what month she was born. Mm -hmm. Because it's September right now in the game. So yeah, she's probably 19. Hmm. What are these two? And Leon's 21. Hey, you can get that other hip pouch if you open that. Handy, bruh. Really handy. Handy. I'll give you a handy. Uh... <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this. Which one was that? Okay. Excited, obviously. No. Okay. All right. Sorry that. No. That's the controller fucking me. Shit. Okay. This. 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 Boy. What? <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> 
<laughs> I know I hate these fucking things. There's at least only two of them in the game. He's done it. Ooh, shit. Damn. And there's a fanny pack inside. Oh, you lied to me. No, you have to go to the back to the security deposit room. Oh. Put that in the three <laughs> slot. <clears throat> what? So what? couldn't he have technically put the two in the three slot? You need two and three, though. Two and three? Yeah. Why is, oh, because it's open two, 203. 203. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that makes more sense. And this game's fucked up and won't let you just rip out the piece. <sighs> yeah, why didn't you just, like, <laughs> grab a knife and then just, like, pop out, like... An, that like, makes it too easy, dude. The batch? Try it. Shit. Oh shit, you're smart. Thanks, you're man. smart, bro. Th th thanks, man. Oh shit. No, you fucked up. You fucked up. I'm what? supposed to go you in the computer. In the oh. <laughs> how did. <to> <laughs> <laughs> Gotta plug that shit in. I know how to computer. You have no inventory slots. I know. I do now. <laughs> okay. You need the badge again. That was loud AF. You have no inventory <laughs> slots. I will in a second. Oh my god. Oh shit. Chris. I'm gonna read it. To my best stars, bud, how are you all doing in that drab old station? Hanging in there against old irons. Me, I just got back from a date with a hot chick. Bet you can guess what we got up to under her extra large umbrella. Ha, huh, get it? <laughs> Europe is amazing. One month is uh, is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months. Uh, Barry, don't even think of coming to join me. Wouldn't want to make all the cute girls cry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so just leave me, leave the babes to me. Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield, August nineteenth. Bum bum no bum. Kidding. <laughs> Chris ain't a douchebag. He's a cool ass mofo. <laughs> you know, there's a fucking there's live like in Resident Evil One, the original. There was live action scenes to it. So really? Like, the, the opening scene is live action, and it's really weird. They all look kind of weird. Um, but there's <laughs> like this other part to it where they're like introducing the characters. Heck it. And it's like Chris Redfield. And he's like smoking a cigarette and everything. <laughs> it's just <laughs> totally off character. But I was like, it was the first <laughs> game, so he didn't really have a character at the time. And um, when they were doing all the uh, the dialogue for it, um, there was like no information or motive or like motivation for like anything their characters were doing. So the the readers were just like throwing a script, and that was it. Wow. So it's like really bland and monotone for the mm -hmm. entire game until they remade it. But yeah, uh, I have a question. I'm just missing yeah. SMG. Uh, so Resident Evil Eight and Nine. Mm -hmm. Uh, how do people know of it? Like, 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 did people allude to it? Is it like in like the lore? Like, like if it's gonna be a thing? Y y like, yeah, because they, because, because you talked about it, but they haven't made it. Is it like a part of the lore? Did they say, hey, there's gonna be nine Resident Evils when they started like three? Like, so usually, like what Chase said earlier, is they do it in like trilogies, sort of. Like, the first three games are based on the T-Virus. Yeah. And then the next three, four, five, and six, were based on uh, the Ouroboros virus. Okay. So people kind of assume that the next game will be based off of, like, the Molded and B.O.W.s and shit like that. Um, but, like, for the eighth game, it's heavily rumored because at the end of the Not A Hero DLC, which is Chris's DLC, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, he was given a new assignment. So ah. There's probably something still going on. Because at the end of the DLC... Like, Chris is hunting Lucas, which is the baker's son, who actually wasn't... He was no longer under Evie's control. Because there was actually a lab underneath their swamp, and he was given the cure. So he, he pretended to still be under her control, but wasn't. Um, okay. Okay. Yeah. So he he, uh, he was taking... Oh, all, shit. Yeah. There's liquors in there. Uh... 
Um, so he was taking on the information and he was sending it to somebody. And that's what Chris stopped. Um, he stopped a bit of it, but they got a good handful of the information. Okay. Yeah. Um, so there's, there, to me, there's two theories on who Lucas was sending it to. I think he was either sending it to Wesker, who is still alive somehow, okay. or he was sending it to Ada. Both very valuable choices yeah just based on what i know yeah 